Hey everyone, how's it going? Logan here from Plugin Tutorials, and today we're going to be starting off a new series of tutorials. Uh, the first part of this is going to be really basic stuff for Photoshop, so let's go ahead and let's open Photoshop first, and I'll let you know what we're doing. So, over here, you have all your different tools and whatnot. I'm going to be making a separate video for each one of these tools. They're going to be really quick videos, and should be able to have all the videos for all the tools out within a week or so, maybe even less. But we're going to get started today with the first one. And we're going to be uh today we're going to be learning about the move tool. Now the move tool is the most basic tool there is. It's not I don't even really consider it a tool myself, but I'm going to show you what it does. So if I create a new layer and I just grab a random color, let's go with a red and I make a rectangle rectangle and then I go up and I select my move tool now I'm gonna also be telling you guys shortcuts for these cuz if you're doing graphic design and whatnot and you're getting paid by the hour what you want to do is you want to make sure you can work as quickly as possible but also really effectively so not only is this better for your employers but it's also helpful to you as well so the the shortcut key for the move tool is uh, you just press V and basically you just select whatever layer you want and you see the transformation box will go around as long as you have the show transformation controls checkbox checked and then you can just move it around so you can move your shape around place it wherever and now you can also move your shape around using your arrow keys uh, it moves at one pixel at a time, but if you hold down the shift button, it'll move at ten pixels at a time, which is quicker. Uh, arrow keys are good for more precise movements, but if you need to move it all the way across the page, just use left click on the mouse. If you right click, click it brings up uh, your layers, so I can switch to layer one and move my background around. Control Z to move that back. Also, if you're in another tool, you can hold down control and that works as well just hold down control and click and move and that's how that works um, so that's the move tool there's not really much else about it um, well I guess I could tell you this if you hold down alt and click on your layer and drag it will duplicate it so you can have lots of red squares or whatever else it is you're doing so thanks for watching everyone this has been the first tutorial in the beginner's uh, Photoshop tutorial series. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you next time.